Lexington's Commission for Racial Justice and Equality has a two month deadline to present recommendations to city leaders to try and help dismantle systemic racism in Fayette County. Evening edition Sophia Millar tuned in to today's education and economic opportunity meeting where a subcommittee continued defining its recommendations. This morning's meeting covered various topics from early childhood education to standardized testing to the state's achievement gap. All topics centered around what details, big and small, to change in order to dismantle systemic racism. Among them, teacher exposure to students of different backgrounds. You know, it's really about, you know, trying to train our teachers at, at our level, training our teachers, you know, um, on how to think about issues of bias. Committee members dedicated time to addressing a gap in representation in classrooms around the state and how that can affect a child's learning experience. You know, if a student of color doesn't see themselves in the curriculum, you know, where, where can they attach to and how can they create a vision for themselves within our community? The Commission on Racial Justice and Equality's goal is to develop solutions to systemic problems across five different areas. For the question of representation in educators, committee members are still discussing the best way to tackle the issue. They have until September to make final recommendations. In Lexington, Sophia Millar, Evening Edition.